Y'all, if you're a fan of the original Karate Kid, man, you gotta see Cobra Kai. Man, that's an awesome show, man. I just uh, found out about it about two days ago. And episode one, you can watch episode one and two for f online for free on YouTube for free without signing up for the trial. That was so good that I signed up for the free trial, a free month's trial. Billing doesn't start to a month after. But wow, it's amazing. It's just, I mean, that's just amazing, man. We know how magical Karate Kid, the original Karate Kid was. We know how magical that was. That was a big influence on my life growing up. Um, a beautiful story. Mr. Miyagi. You know, it was a beautiful movie, man. Uh, brought, brought out all the emotions and everybody could relate to it. You know, the kids could relate to it. It was a beautiful movie, man. And they brought that magic back, man. It is, you know, you got to thank the creative forces of the universe, man. Got to thank God. You got to thank whoever you serve, man. Be that these guys are still alive to do this. I know Mr. Miyagi, Pat Morita is dead, but um, for the most part, the main characters are still alive. Daniel LaRusso and Johnny Lawrence. They're not their real names, but and they didn't screw this up because they could they could have easily screwed this up. Um this is great, man. Uh the the, the writing is great. The scenes are great. You know, um Daniel LaRusso's character, he he has to loosen up a little bit, but he seems to be getting back in that mode. You know, it's crazy because he was the um, he was the guy that people betted against in the original Karate movie. You know, he was the new guy in town to lose. Not 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 really like a loser, but yeah, you could say a loser, loser type guy. Didn't have really no friends. Uh, trying to fit in. Trying to learn his way, and it's it's hard for a new kid to fit in, you know. And uh, he was the guy that people was betting against, you know, the have not. You know what I'm saying? Um, and Johnny, he had all. He was the popular kid in high school. Had all the friends. Girls like them, you know, so. But that's just in real life because now, as 34 years later, now Daniel LaRusso is the man. Has his own car. He's a car salesman. He has his own car lot. He's a big time. I mean, he look like he's a millionaire. He's a big time guy. And it's funny how roles reverse. Now Johnny, now Johnny, um, now he's the loser. He's the alcoholic. You know, he's trying to find his way. But that's just how life works, you know. The loser in high school ends up being the winner. The winner in high school, the popular guy in high school, a lot of times end up being the loser later on in life. It's just funny how life works sometimes. Um, but this is a great story, man. I'm, I, I like how they flipped it. Uh, it makes it more dynamic. It makes it, you know, it makes it more juicy. You know how they flip the script, and you, and you see the good. You see the good and the bad. You you, you see. I like, and, and and I really am interested in Johnny's character because you can still see that he still kind of he still has that assholeism in him in him, but at the same time he seems to be grown. He seems to have grown. I mean, he's a grown ass man. He seems to have outgrown that stuff, but he still has a little bit of that in him at the same time. Sort of like a Stone Cold Steve Austin. You're cheering on the bad guy that don't give a fuck. You're cheering him on, but at the same time, he still has some good in him because he's grown and matured, mentally matured a little more. 
but yet he still has that bad boy element in him too. And Daniel LaRusso, he's changed too. He's a little bit more cocky now, a little bit more arrogant. He still has that foundation of goodness within him. Still deep down in his center, he's still a good guy, but as life has progressed, he has become successful and his ego, sometimes his ego gets in the way and sometimes he forget where he come from. And sometimes he has to revisit what Mr. Miyagi taught him to bring him back to balance. But it's a beautiful movie, man. I love it, man. I've been watching. I've been, I clapped a couple times <laughs> during it. It's not a movie, it's a series. And I clapped a couple times during some of the episodes, man, because it's just beautiful. It's a beautiful thing to watch. And we don't really get too many gems nowadays. And this is a rare gem. I love it, man. This is one of those rare gems that I would watch. And I don't watch TV. But this is one of those rare gems that rare gems that I'm thankful that they made it. And I'm glad to watch it. Bringing back that nostalgia, man. So, so check out Cobra Kai, man. It's pretty damn good. Peace out.